What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am so excited for today's video. I am finally going to do a full review of Ghost Supplements. This video has been a long time coming. I have been teasing it on my Instagram for a few weeks now, for a few months, um, but I really wanted to put all of the supplements to the test before giving my final thoughts. So without further ado, I finally have the review video for you. All right. To start off, I just want to mention that I have been an avid Run Everything Labs supplement user for over a year. They're kind of a small company, so they were constantly out of stock of pre-workout and things like that. So I found it a little bit frustrating to have to wait until certain flavors I liked were back in stock or pre-workout was back in stock. So I thought it would be a great time to try out Ghost Supplements as I've seen it all over Instagram and just kind of put it to the test. So I have here the vegan pancake batter protein. This one is completely empty. There's maybe one scoop left in there. And then I also have the vegan peanut butter cereal milk protein here. I have the fat burner. It's called burn in flavor pina colada. Again, this has basically nothing in it anymore. And their pre-workout legend, I have this in the grapefruit flavor. I know that's not really focusing, so my apologies. But yeah, again, I'm pretty much at the bottom of that tub as well. And I did pick up one of their shakers um, when I placed my order. So let's start off with price point. So one of the reasons I went with Ghost was they were currently having a buy one, get one protein deal. So I thought it would be the perfect time to try it out and just kind of get more bang for my buck. So a typical tub is $44.99 and there are a ton of influencer codes that you can put on top of that to get 20% off your entire order, um, which I did end up doing. So I got two tubs for $44.99 with whatever discount I had on top of that. And I do think that that's a little hi but when you put the discount code on it it's not too bad um, when you do get the tub it's filled to like maybe here so the tub looks huge i mean this is literally compared to my head it's like a massive tub of protein as far as flavor for these i really really love 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 the pancake batter one but it is a pretty distinct flavor so one of the things i've struggled with with both of these is just that the flavor isn't plain enough to mix into smoothies without it being noticeable. Sometimes I just want like a plain vanilla that will just mix with anything. Um, and the same goes for the peanut butter cereal milk. It is very similar to the taste of Reese's Puff cereal, which is great. I actually love this when I make a protein batter where you do one scoop of the protein, you add in some almond milk, and just kind of slowly mix it and it gets this batter consistency. And then I add one scoop of peanut butter and oh my God, that is so good. So I definitely like the flavors of these. As far as the ingredients, there are a decent amount of ingredients. We've got pea protein, pumpkin protein, watermelon seed protein, natural and artificial flavors. That's a little eh, like what are the artificial flavors? Peanut flour, sunflower creamer, tapioca, starch, tapioca dextrin, dextrin uh, salt, sucralose, and xanthan gum. I don't know how to say that either. I'm going to actually grab a tub of the Run Everything Labs protein that Tanner is still using and I will compare it. The biggest difference between the two is that these both contain sucralose, which sucralose isn't great for you from my understanding just not enough research to determine if that sweetener has good or bad effects um, i know that a lot of nutritionists advise against sucralose and avoiding it so that's something to consider with both of these proteins but overall they were really great i did like that they blended really well mixed within my smoothies they didn't get chunky tastes really freaking good for vegan protein, definitely unique flavors. I absolutely love the packaging. These bottles just feel and look high quality in my opinion, and their branding is just on point. If you like something more plain and versatile, then maybe go with 
a brand that has vanilla or just chocolate um, because these can be pretty unique and I'm somebody who usually makes shakes and I like when it can kind of just mix with different kinds of shakes. I found myself making the same protein shakes and protein batters with these instead of being able to throw in different berries. This is the pancake batter. I didn't love the flavor of this mixed with like blueberries and strawberries. It was just like off. I don't know, it wasn't my favorite. But on their own as a protein batter or if you're doing a very basic protein shake like almond milk, bananas, peanut butter, ice, it's great. Moving on to the pre-workout. The flavor of this pre-workout, this is the Grapefruit Legend is so freaking good like i actually crave this every single day and i found that it didn't make me feel super jittery and it wasn't very intense of a pre-workout and i don't know if that's because i'm somebody who drinks a ton of caffeine or can handle caffeine really well but i didn't find this to be like crazy i need to go pump right now like it wasn't like that at all it's a very clean feeling pre-workout in my opinion so i like it but i think i want something moving forward that has more of that oomph like i want something that's like whoa i need to work out but as for the packaging again i don't know if this will like actually zoom in let's see i don't want to mess with it because it'll make me not in focus and i hate when that happens so the actual texture of this tub is raised like a grapefruit which i think that's like a really nice touch overall it's good it wasn't my favorite pre-workout that i've ever tried what i had been doing was mixing the burn thermogenic and if you don't know what a thermogenic or a fat burner is it's a supplement that you take to use your core body temperature so you end up sweating more and burning more calories so this isn't something i know people get confused about fat burners Fat burners are used as a supplement to your already existing workout routine. You don't buy a fat burner, drink it, not work out, and think that you're going to lose weight or burn fat. That's not how it works. It raises your core body temperature so you're sweating more and you are burning more calories within your workout. So what I did was mix these two as my pre-workout drink in my little blender bottle and I love the flavor of these together. Like the grapefruit with the pina colada flavor was so good. Like I kind of just want to get it again because I love this flavor combo and like I've just been starting my mornings with it and then I work out right after and it's just such a nice way to wake up in the morning. So yeah, I think that this really worked. I found that the times that I took this I was sweating more during my workouts and I've been loving using this while I'm at home because sometimes my home workouts just aren't as intense when I'm not lifting heavy and when I'm home and I you know take this combo I'm actually finding that I'm like sweating a lot during my workouts and just feeling warmer and I can tell that it's working but as for my physique change there i feel like there hasn't been that big or, or noticeable of a difference yeah overall i did like adding this into my routine i would definitely order this again and maybe try a different flavor yeah i i enjoyed using these products but did i think that i needed them that's a different story oh and before i forget i want to tell you guys how much these costs hey okay, the burn is also 44.99 and Pre-workout is $44.99. So everything is $44.99. Again, there are tons of discount codes you can put on top of that. And also, one other thing, I'm never gonna be able to finish this video. I love that the Ghost website has a bunch of different bundles. So they will have like, these four things could be a bundle or an influencer where they pick out their favorites flavors of each product and then they make a bundle so it comes out to a discounted price which i think that's pretty cool and i'm pretty sure you can put a code on top of that as well so there's a lot of ways to make the prices cheaper and i'm going to include this little blender bottle in my review because this actually is a legit blender bottle this isn't one that's gonna leak it's not just like an added on you know bonus free content type of blender bottle this is actually like a sturdy 
nice blender bottle. I use this to drink my pre-workouts because I don't actually use blender bottles to mix my protein with water. I always make it into a shake with my Nutribullet. So I always use this for my pre-workout combo. And it, I love it. It's a great blender bottle. I use this every single day. Overall, I think Ghost is a great brand. I think that they put so much attention to detail into their products. I mean, the top of these tubs are all embossed with Ghost. Oh, and I almost forgot. One other thing that's really cool, I thought, is in each tub, they have this little card that's like a loyalty card, and all of mine had them. And it has a code on the back, and you go and you redeem the code, and it gives you points towards future orders. So it's kind of like this cool little reward program. You have to find it within your protein. Um, and I thought that was a really nice touch. And that just goes again with my point of, I think that they just pay really close attention to detail. They have gorgeous packaging. Everything seems really high quality. I mean, these unique flavors were really good. You like trying different flavors that are unique, then go with these. I haven't tried any of their whey protein products because I am dairy free. And again, they do only have these two and I think they just added chocolate as vegan options. So I would love to see their vegan protein options expand and I would love actually if they did the Chips Ahoy protein that they have as a vegan option because I've been dying to try that and I don't even drink dairy. I would buy from them again. Overall, this is approved by me. I will be trying a different brand next time so that I can do a full review and just kind of branch out, see what else is out there. I'm thinking of doing Alani Nutrition or First Form, not sure yet. Let me know if you guys have any preferences to supplement brands you want me to try in this series in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Make sure that you subscribe on YouTube and make sure you give me a follow on Instagram at Workouts with Erica. I hope to be posting more review content for you and I will see you guys in my next video. Oh, and lastly, I'm gonna shamelessly plug myself this dyed shirt that I'm wearing. I hand dyed it with bleach and I think it turned out really sick. If you want to follow that page, it is created X Chaos. Um, I will be hopefully putting some dyes on sale soon so you guys can get your hands on some custom swaggy. That's really it. I promise I'm leaving. Love you.